Hi, this is Nancy Rolfsma with On Point TV and Quilting with Nancy. And I'd like to thank you for watching this video. This video is going to be about an upcoming show. So American Quilt Society, the AQS, has a big show coming up in Daytona Beach, Florida in February, which honestly, if you're from the Midwest like I am up here in Michigan, February in Florida sounds like a really good idea. And then some of you might already be down there. You snowbirds might already be down in the Florida or the southern areas and might not be that long of a drive. Keep in mind, this show is on Daytona Beach. So right there by the beach, it's going to be a beautiful setting. For this show, I will be teaching electric quilt designing classes. So I've got a full range of classes ranging from very beginner all the way up to a little bit more advanced. So if you've just started with electric quilt or maybe you've had it for a while, but you've never felt like you've really cracked into all of the possibilities for design that it has, I think my classes would really help you out. So I want to share with you a screen and take you through just so that you can see some of what I will be showing you in the classes. So a couple of the classes are going to be for beginners. So in these classes, I'll take you through the very beginning steps of electric quilt. On the quilt work table, the black work table, all the different things that you need to know to get started. So one of the ones that I think is always very exciting is where you can start with these quick quilt projects. And here, EQ has laid out these designs for you. So these are already set up. You can pick any one of these designs. And in class, I'll take you through the steps for doing some coloring. So we'll learn about the layout options, whether or not you want nine inch block or maybe a 12 inch block is more your style. And then we'll deal with borders and design using all the different blocks and the fabric tools. There's so many great fabrics available in electric quilt, the sky is really the limit. So those would be the getting started in designing and the back to basics. The next one I wanna show you, let's go find another file here. Oops, open one of my files, is applique. I'm gonna be talking to you about, oops, I gotta say, uh, yep. <laughs> So these little things that we learn. Nope, I don't want to save that one. Let's try that one again. I want to open this and I don't want to save the changes. There we go. Now we're back on track. So with the applique, I'll be teaching you how to make applique blocks. Now here's just a few that I've made, but along with the applique blocks that, are, that you'll design yourself, there's also a ton of blocks available in EQ already. We go down here, here is the classic applique, and there's just such a wide range of applique blocks. What's fun about them is that not only will you learn to make the quilt with them, but I will also teach you how to edit those blocks. So if I take one of these blocks, I can take that and I can edit it to be anything that I want. So in the class, we'll really learn about these little nodes here and how you're able to adjust your applique to be just what you want it to be. The next class after that, let's see, let's open up the medallion style quilts. Medallion style quilts are seriously my favorite style of quilts. So here is just a few of them that I very quickly put together. There's a lot of the layouts already available in EQ's libraries, but then there's so many different things that you can do with the many layouts. So this one here at the top, this is my learning to quilt. My learning to quilt pattern and design actually was completely designed in electric quilt. And using one of their layouts, I was able to create the blocks that I wanted to use. So there's some very simple ones, and then you can make them very, very complex. It's a fabulous program for doing all sorts of different things like that. All right, the next one will be designing custom sets. Oh my goodness, custom sets are so fun because instead of the design already being pre-designed for you, like, you know, you have a 12 inch block and it's gonna set in place, with custom sets, it's a blank palette. And with that blank palette, you're able to learn how to take those, let me go here, I'm gonna go to my block tools, adjust. I can take that block, I can put it literally anywhere I want it to be. I can adjust the sizes of it, I can adjust the, um, 
the locations of them. I can rotate them so that I can make these wherever I want them to be. Now, this is a great option for design if you have a lot of orphan blocks, and most of us do. So when you're wondering, what am I possibly gonna do with all those orphan blocks? The custom set will actually help you with this. Um, learning how to put the um, spacers in everything, it's very, very fun. My favorite thing to do with custom sets is to design t-shirt quilts. I absolutely love designing t-shirt quilts. And I'll take like, this is a t-shirt quilt that was 14 by 14 and it will be placed here. And so I'm able to take those um, t-shirt quilt t-shirts and actually put them anywhere I want. So I'm able to figure out a very creative, but yet simple to construct way to make this t-shirt quilt. The next quilt, their next class rather, will be New York Beauties and always has been, will probably continue to be my favorite block. I love making New York Beauties. I've made so many different types and styles of them, but what we'll really learn in class, not only about layout, but we will learn the idea of drawing your own New York Beauties. So taking in, oops, not that arch. That's not the one that we wanted. Um, yeah, draw. Nope, I want to draw the arch. Okay, not the lines. I'll teach you about doing lines too. And right this very second, I am not finding my arch setting. I know that it's here somewhere. Let's grab a new block. Easy draw. Nope, I don't want to save that one because that was my mistake. There it is. There's my arch tool. You can create arches. And with those arches, you create wonderful New York Beauties. Not only in all of these classes, I actually will take you and teach you how to, um, to, to well, with the New York Beauty. Okay, let's stick with this one here a second. So I'm going to partition this and I'm going to angle that one. So I'm going to do that and we're going to apply that. We're going to come down here. We're going to apply this. These are the simple techniques that you will learn in the New York Beauty class. Learning how to create the nodes on each of the arch and where you put an arch and where do you put lines. And with each of these classes, I will actually bring samples of quilts that I have made so that, oops, I make a boo-boo there, but you'll understand what I'm doing. I'm doing everything so fast. But you'll understand how to make these quilts. So I've got lots and lots of samples of things that I have done. You'll also learn in all of the classes how to print the block. You'll be able to print the foundation piecing, the rotary cutting, the templates, whatever it is that you need. So I'll be introducing you to all of that. And hopefully in all of the classes, if there's time, I'll even show you how to import fabrics. Um, importing fabrics means that you can take anybody's designs and you can take those designs right off of the manufacturer's website. So, you know, always be able to have the most current fabrics, maybe the ones that you just went to the quilt shop and purchased. And by importing those designs, you're able to really use those in the quilts while you're designing, know exactly how much fabric that you need. The templates are printed, the rotary cutting instructions are printed. And as I mentioned, in all of my classes, I will bring samples of quilts that I have made using these techniques. So the information for the AQS show is below in the um, information for this little video here. It'll take you directly to the link. There are, I think, 17 or 18 different teachers, a wide range of classes. So in my classes, you would only be bringing your computer and a notebook because we'll be working right there, hands on in the electric book program. I also have a lecture and I'll be part of the, um, the STARS, the, the, the star night. I can't remember what it's called right now, but you'll know what it is when you look onto the registration form. So please take a look at the AQS show listing for the Daytona show. It's in February, the perfect time to be in Florida. Thank you for listening. And if you have any questions, as always, just email me at quiltingwithnancy.com. Have a great day.